demons are stepping up their game. These guys are worse than fit. Heart to heart time. Are you not loved enough as demon baby? Dad to it holding? Mom not around? Let you cry all night? Gearing up for something big. There's the sage entrance, and we'll be right out front. <sighs> Sounds like a lot of people out there. You'll be fine, honey. The last time I gave a speech, I was in high school. Miss Steinberg gave me a C minus. <laughs> well, if only Miss Steinberg could see you now. Hey. You got this, Dad. I mean, come on, you saved Spider-Man. I'm pretty sure that makes you an official superhero. <laughs> a superhero? <laughs> or maybe I'm just a guy who doesn't give up. <laughs> Not honey. Welcome, everyone. And before I hand it off to Mayor Osborne, I'd just like to say a few words. Our city is so, so? Such exemplary citizens I think this gang war may finally be over. With that, like, I would like, to hand like it over, over? over? Oh, I'm, I mean, there's some loose ends still to be tied up, but... Loose ends? Well, a truck pulled away from the scene from a company called Consolidated Shipping. Something's not right about it. I just don't know what. Hmm. Well, maybe after this we can grab some coffee. Figure it out together. Yeah. Um... Well, thanks, Jim. Couldn't have said it better myself, but I'll try. We all know that Officer Davis is a hero. But, uh, instead of coffee, maybe we could have dinner instead. I, I could come over, uh, I'll cook. Or we could... You know, meet at a totally neutral location for a completely normal meal, cooked by professionals. <laughs> for acts of extraordinary bravery, above and beyond the call of duty, 
it is my privilege to present Officer Jefferson Davis with a Department Medal of Honor. Phone call, sir. Kind of in the middle of something here, Jim. Sounds urgent, sir. Fine. Congratulations, sir. Uh, thank you, Mr. Mayor. I share this honor with my family. My wife, Rio, and my son, Miles. Without their support, I... I couldn't do what I do. Yes? I've worked many years for this moment. Who is this? Over the coming days, your company, your city, and everything you care about will be destroyed. People will beg you for help, but you won't be able to save them. <laughs> Listen, jackass. I get threats like this twice a week. Why don't you grow a pair and tell me what you want? To watch you suffer. Over there. I have to go find Dad, okay? No, wait. 
Miles, no! Miles, no! Dad's in there. I'll find him. Right there! What the hell? Where do you think you're going? What? Sun Kai, you can pull I can circle around the edge to get past them. Through there. Not yet. They'll see me. Okay. Can't cross yet. I was right there. Gotta help him. Now. to leave.
Dad! Dad! Dad, no! Wake up, Dad. Wake up. Wake up. I'm sorry for your loss. Do I know you? I'm Peter Parker. I was at City Hall when... Look, I know you don't know me, but I just wanted to say... I know what you're going through. Uh, that's what you were going to say, right? Or it all gets easier with time. Don't worry. It's, it's part of God's plan. I'm sorry. I was just try trying to help. I know. I'm sorry about that. I don't know what I'm going to do with him. Have you started looking for Martin Lee yet? No. I told you, I can't start a manhunt based on a hunch from Spider-Man. But I'm telling you, he's the guy! Get me some solid evidence and we'll talk. Solid evidence. Right. Hey, it's me. Hey, so what are you thinking? I'm thinking I screwed up. And that kid lost his father. I know you too well to say you should give yourself a break. What about the police? Do they have any leads on me? They're not even looking for him. Even Yuri doesn't believe me. Then it's up to us to find him. I've been doing some research. Go to this address. Martin Lee bought a controlling interest in this recycling center last year. You think he's hiding out there? Maybe. We know he's not at Feast. If he's not at the recycling center, maybe you'll find some evidence as to where he might be. Yeah. Good work, MJ. I'll let you know what I find. Oh, one more thing. I talked with a detective about questioning the arrested demons. They're all claiming Martin Lee has the power to, quote, corrupt people. Corrupt? What does that mean? They say it's sort of like mind control. It brings out the negative part of you. It makes you do things you wouldn't normally do. Uh, sounds a little far-fetched. This is coming from a guy who can run up walls. MJ's hunch was right. Place is crawling with demons. Gotta take these guys out, then have a look around.
Okay, that's all of them. Oh, high security lock. They use these on banks, not recycling centers. Maybe if I can find where it gets its power from. Looks like I could override the circuit. Need my electric webs. Well, that did something. It looks like the circuits need a little more juice. Find a junction box. There. Looks like the circuit's still stable. Maybe there's another junction box close by. Gotcha. Almost there. One more box should do it. Uh-huh. That's it! Man. These must be where they're planning to attack. Wait. These are Osborne campaign offices. All the paths originate from the same address. Lots of high-tech equipment. Maybe later I can recycle this stuff into some weapons of my own. Explosives from Fisk's construction site. Truck bombs? This is crazy! Guns from Fisk's armory. This wasn't a gang war. The demons were stealing from Fisk to go after Mayor Osborne. Hey, did you find Lee? No, but you were right. Lee's using this place as a front for the demons. Bomb making, gun running. Oh my god. And it looks like they're planning another attack. This time on Norman Osborne's campaign offices. We must have some kind of beef with Norman Osborne. I found an address here. I think it's their staging area. If I hurry, I might be able to stop them. Be careful. Yuri, it's me. Make it quick. I'm busy getting yelled at by my boss. Martin Lee and the demons are planning another attack, this time on Norman Osborne's campaign offices. Are you sure? We've had a lot of false leads in the past week. Trust me on this one. I'm sending you the address of a recycling center. You'll find all the evidence there. Got it. I'll get those campaign offices evacuated. But if you're wrong about this, you're gonna help me find a new job.
consolidated shipping. A lot of guys. I should try to do this quietly. But also with style. I can use that stuff I found at the recycling center. Nice! Love using bad guys' own weapons against them. You're and that, my friends, is what karmic justice looks like. I lost him. Sleep it off.
Nice. I'm invisible again. Not out here. Better check inside. Huh. Invoice from an auto shop. Pale horse rides. That's one expensive tune up. What else can I find around here? They have bases all around the city. This is bigger than I thought. Looks like the demons have an army. As if one deadly glowing whip wasn't enough. Expecting, but it was definitely not this. Hey, MJ, I think I stopped the demon's attack on Osborne's campaign office. Did you find Lee? No, but I found something we should look into. A place called Pale Horse Rides. Sounds familiar. I'll check it out and get back to you.
sending to location. There's another one. Safety's off. Well, this is new. No, no, no. This one's mine. All right. I'm executing this son of a... Hey! That's not how we do things! Down! Down! Code SM-1. Whoa, whoa! Before we do this, who the hell are you guys? Code SM-1. Code SM-1. Holding for orders. Copy Code SM-1. I have a visual. Hold for Silverburn. Nice entrance. Solid 8 out of 10. Nine out of ten. Release him. He works with us. Yuri, explanation, please. This is Silver Sablanova, head of Sable International, a private security force. Paid for by Mayor Osborne. Oh, the mayor has a pet army now? Next time you get in my way, I will not be so gentle. Go. We'll talk later. Hey, sorry about that Sable thing. I should have told you earlier, but it all happened so fast. It's okay. We're still best buds. We're not best buds. Well, that took a dark turn. Anyway, Sable has the mayor's ear and unchecked authority. We've searched that address you gave me, found plenty of evidence of a bomb plot, but nothing that leads back to Martin Lee. I'm working on that. Hey, MJ. Hey, so I dredged up some records on Martin Lee's other business holdings. He's got places all over the city. Huh. The locations line up with a map I found at that shipping business. I'll check them out. Let me know what you find at each one, and I'll work on building a case. You got it. I'm headed to Lee's office at Feast to see if I can learn more about why he's doing this. And what he's got planned next. Okay. Say hi to May for me. Wait, you don't think she's in danger, do you? No. Lee's only got one target on his mind. Norman Osborne. Missed another call from Doc. Peter. So if you're running this place while Mr. Lee's out of town, who's doing your old job? <laughs> Me. But I could always use more help. You know anyone? Actually, I do. His name is Miles Morales. Why does that sound familiar? His father was being honored at City Hall. Oh. I talked to him at the funeral. He's a smart kid. He's just having a tough time. I knew a boy like that once. I remember it helped to uh, stay busy. It might help him too. Here's his mom's number. Thanks. I'll give her a call. Hey, you haven't heard from Mr. Lee, have you? No, why? I'm just curious. I've got a few minutes before work. I'm gonna look around, see if there's anything else I can do to help you out. Oh, you, you don't have to. I know. I want to. I should check out Lee's office. Pete. Glad to see you're okay. Hanging in there. This office is locked. How do I get in there? Quietly. I don't 
don't feel safe anymore. Maybe there's a vent somewhere. Huh. Never seen that room before. Whoa, what the... High voltage lines. What needs this much power? There. I understand, but the account number is in Mr. Lee's office, which is inaccessible. I will call you back as soon as I can get that information. What are you hiding, Lee? Lee sure is obsessed with masks. Is it a Jungian thing? Like, he needed to pretend to be someone else to let his darkest feelings out? Pretended to be a demon, until he became one. Lee's giving his powers to the others. How does Lee imbue these with his power? Bioelectric induction? Compressed phase shift? This is all about Norman Osborne. His whole career. Lee must have been obsessed with him. Lee was keeping tabs on Wilson Fisk, too. Trying to predict when he'd fall. Creepy. Can feel my power growing, feeding off my anger. Father would say I've lost the path of balance, but he could never understand. The only way to fight a monster is to become one. This is the folder MJ found at the auction house. This might help us figure out what Lee's planning next. Phew. It's a burn room, wired to destroy evidence. Need to overload those junction boxes. One more. The police had found this. Or May. Don't want to think of what could have happened. Now, how do I get out of here? Hello, Peter. Mr. Lee. I thought you were out of town. Did you find what you were looking for? Martin, you're back. I get that. Thank you. And heading off again shortly, I'm afraid. Just needed a few things from my office. You must have heard about City Hall. Yes. Tragic. Peter was there. He was very lucky. And an Osborne rally. I didn't know you were a fan. Well, 
What matters is, you are both safe. Amen. But the bombers are still out there. Who knows what they've planned next? Oh, I don't think you or May have anything to worry about. As long as you stay away from places you're not supposed to be. Well, I should go. When will you be back? When my work is done. Wait, wait, wait! Captain Watanabe. I finally got your evidence. Head to the Feast Center in Chinatown. What am I going to find? A nice lady named Mae Parker. And some really weird stuff hidden in Lee's office. But listen, he's got another attack planned. Where? When? Still working on that, but I think he's going to use something called Devil's Breath. Sounds destructive. What is it? A substance created by Oscorp. Probably a bioweapon of some kind. I have a folder full of info on it. I'm holding on to it for now. I'll send copies as soon as I can. Okay, we'll check his office. If the evidence stands up, I'll put out an APB. MJ, hey! Just checking in! Peter, hey! Can I call you back? I think you'll want to hear this. Wait! Why are you whispering? Just... in the middle of something. How about we catch up over dinner? My place? Oh, sure! I'll even cook! Cool. See ya. Wait, remember how you told me about Lee's corrupting touch? I think I just saw it in action. How? Some perfectly nice homeless people just jumped me. Thing is, they had glowing eyes. And I remembered Yuri... Bird watching? Got some pictures over there! Oh, way around. Oh, shit. Can't have the ones inside feeling left out. Going down! MJ, I'm at the first location on your list, and guess what I found? Demons? Give the lady a prize. See if you can figure out what they're up to while I introduce myself. Operation 
老板就指望我们了。我从未侍奉过这样的力。我也是，他的慷慨没有极限，这是我从没感受过的归属感。我了解，可我们是来做事的。Something I want is a memento. Drugs? Demons. Looks like they bring in their buddies in shipping containers. Explains how foreign nationals with criminal records are getting into the country.
MJ, call the police. All the demons are incapacitated. Don't forget to bring me a souvenir. And I'm back. Like I was saying, some perfectly nice homeless people just jumped me. Thing is, they had glowing eyes. And I remembered Yuri telling me something similar about the guard who released Shocker. So Shocker was working for Lee? Uh, it's all connected. There's more. But I guess we'll talk about it at dinner. Yeah, see ya. Dinner? <sighs> what should I cook? Oh, hi, Doctor. How are you? Parker! Exciting news! Come by the lab! Uh, like, now? This is my defining moment. Can't wait to show you. Cool! Um, I've got dinner plans. Can I come by later? Dinner can wait. You need to see this, Peter. Uh, okay. Be right there. Wonder if this means I have a job again. Guess I can stop by, just for a minute. Stable control. Need a report of the situation north of Houston. Today is a day for somber reflection. For mourning and honoring fallen heroes like Jefferson Davis. But it's also a day to vow never again. It stops here. Some people say I blame everything on Spider. -Man. Well, I don't blame him for the problem. That cowardly act is squarely the responsibility of whoever committed. If we're gonna keep New York safe, we can no longer tolerate the kind of lawlessness Spider-Man and his ilk represent. This is our city. By God, we're gonna take it back. Ha! Ah, the pigeon! And the chase is on. I hope nobody sees me doing this. Gotcha! This is Stable Control. The boss wants a sit rep on the garrison in Chelsea. Control, rooftop outpost under fire for Steven. Dudes. Although it's kind of rude you didn't. Hey, Doctor. Hello, Peter. I'll be just a minute. Wow. Look at all this new stuff.
We really need to get better about organizing our work. Where did you get all this equipment? Called in every last favor. Took out a few loans. It's like we're starting over once again. But this time's going to be different. You've been busy. Just getting started. You know, until now, we've been looking at prosthetics from the wrong perspective. Why restore people to what they were when we can make them better? Okay, I think that should do it. You ready? Everything okay? Damn it! This is all your fault, Norman, you son of a- Well, I know who you're not voting for in the next election. Sorry. I uh, have a habit of making bad jokes in tense situations. <laughs> uh, it was a good joke, Parker. Just a bit of an overreaction on my part. No, don't worry. Uh, why don't you take a break? I'll, uh, I'll clean this up and uh, get us ready for another test. So, uh, hope you don't mind me asking, but it seems you and Norman have a bit of a history. We were lab partners in college. Became friends. Decided to start a business. We both had visions of changing the world just in different ways. Wait, you were at Oscorp when it started? I'm half the reason it's called Oscorp. In grad school, everyone called us the O's. <sighs> Add Corp to that and, well, it is a catchy name. Well, why'd you leave? Norman became more and more obsessed with genetics. He started a project I considered unethical. And there was this... Anyway, lawyers got involved. I chose to leave in exchange for a settlement. But that money didn't last very long. I've relied on grants ever since. If this project doesn't work... Don't worry. It'll work. Uh, let, me, let me just fix this up. I'll brew some fresh coffee. Be sure to run a diagnostic on the control unit. Could be a short. Oh. Why don't you do the honors this time? I think we did it. Next step, neural interface. That's a lot of work for you to do by yourself. You sure you can handle it? Apparently not, judging by today's debacle. Because I still haven't found another job. My funds are still... I know. It's okay. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. What's a few bucks when you're trying to change the world, right? To changing the world. I missed a call from MJ. Doctor, I need to go, but I'll be back later.
Hey, sorry I missed your call. We still on for dinner? Dinner? Oh, yeah. I was calling you about something else, but yeah, we should talk over dinner. Offer still stands for me to come over and cook. Oh, really? Well, I like to take risks. I'm still out, but I'll grab some stuff at the store and let you know when I'm home. Okay, talk soon. All right, dinner at MJ's. No expectations. It'll be hard to screw this one up. Guess I'll just freelance for a while until she calls. Hey. Shots fired, officers down. Backup needed in the meatpacking district. Over. Demons are getting bolder. Engaging police in the streets now. are total fanatics. Can't believe how loyal they are to Martin Lee. Stay safe out there, officer. There's more where these came from. Triggered a bomb. I've got to disable it. These demons must have crazy insurance premiums. Hey, MJ. to see what you come up with. Swinging over now. Prepare to be amazed. <laughs> this is Control. Where are 
are we with Union Square? APC under fire. Repeat, we are taking fire. Hey, I'm not with those guys, but I'm still gonna kick your butts. Demons for good. Your assistance wasn't necessary. But it was fun. Step in before they rack up a body count. Okay, the people in the top floor apartments are really annoyed with you right now. No need to thank me, Sable dudes. Although it's kind of rude you didn't. You are not going to believe what happened. So you know that address you gave me? I went there. MJ. I know, I know, but wait. What is this? Just listen. Okay, I want to say don't ever do that again, but since I know you're going to anyway, here. Take a few of those next time. Nice. Thanks. You know Tombstone is crazy and pretty much invincible, right? Everybody has their weakness. Mine is... whatever you're cooking right now. <laughs> it smells amazing. The chicken curry. Uh, it just needs some time to simmer. No dumplings, I hope. You're never gonna let me live that one down, are you? Nope. <laughs> the Great Dumpling Catastrophe. I still can't believe they evacuated the entire building. I know, and in January, too. <laughs> Your neighbors hated me. Yeah, they were pretty happy when we broke up. <laughs> yeah. So, 
Let's talk about what you found in Lee's office. Well, Lee clearly has issues with Norman Osborne. Yeah, but... but why? I don't know yet. But his next move looks like it involves devil's breath. Whatever that is. Yeah. I'll dig into it. So I was thinking... What if we teamed up? What, what, you want to be my sidekick? Like a spider girl? Spider woman. No. Woman. No, not a sidekick. A partner. Oh. Not again. Ah. Hey, it's your crime system thingy. Looks like a residential break-in. Charles Standish. Hmm. That sounds familiar. Oh, Oscorp CFO. Wait. You don't think this has anything to do with Lee, do you? Sorry to cook and run. Did, did you just leave your clothes on the kitchen floor? Uh... Where, where do you want me to, uh... Just the couch is fine. <laughs> uh, see you later? Yeah. Hey, it's me. This curry is legit. So what do we know about Charles Standish? Let's see. Chief Financial Officer at Oscorp. Single. Known for his art collection. If Lee's after him, it's gotta be related to Devil's Breath. I'll run a search on everything in that file. Let me know the second you find something. I think Lee might be planning something even worse than City Hall. So, are we partners now? Cause it sure feels like we are. Partners! Uh, sounds good! Okay. See ya, partner. Police look like they could use some help. There's probably more of them inside. You guys stay here. Somebody was in a hurry. I'm okay, but you gotta find Mr. Standish, fast. Those guys in the masks kidnapped him and forced him up to his place. He lives in the penthouse, top floor. Okay, sit tight. So glad you're here. I can't find my car. Could have sworn I parked on this level.
You guys work here too? This building is serious about parking enforcement. Good fight! A for effort! That elevator won't work, they know I'm here. Maybe I can sneak up through the elevator shaft. Should be able to make it up to the penthouse from here. If I get closer, I can take him out. <laughs> Okay, almost there. Stay out of the light. Okay, back to Sneaky Spider. Nice and easy. Tall building. Fire bombs? Seriously? There's Standish. Okay, now what? Enter your password. He sounds nervous. Maybe I should take him out.
honest, that one looks better broken. Clear. Hope Standish is all right. Try this again. It's safe now. What were they after? Just financial records. About Devil's Breath? How do you know about that? Why do they want it? I don't even know what it is. Mr. Osborne's been pouring money into it for years, but he keeps the whole project a secret. I'm the only one who has any record of it. Not anymore. Looks like they copied some records to a secure server. Payroll information. On a Dr. Isaac Delaney. Who is he? I, I honestly don't know. Down! <laughs> 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 You okay? Yeah. I think so. Good. Good. You know, as elevator shafts go, this is pretty nice. <laughs> hey, Yuri. You okay? Yeah. But I didn't get much out of Standish before these Sable guys stepped in and told me to back off. What's the deal? I get the sense all they care about is keeping him quiet. Because he knows about Devil's Breath. Right. Whatever the hell that is. I'm working on that. I think I just got a lead. A lead? You sound like a cop. Don't you mean... Spider Cop? Uh, Yuri? That's fair. What happened with Standish? He's safe. Okay, good. And the demons? They were looking for a name. You got a pen? Yeah, go. Dr. Isaac Delaney. Okay. Who is he? What's his deal? I was hoping you could tell me. I'm on it. Just give me a few. Oh, and before I forget, you left that tracker from Tombstones at my place. I'll drop it at Dr. Octavius's lab. Let you know what I find on Delaney. Spider-Man! 
Man, I need help. Are you okay, ma'am? Carmen, and I'm fine. It's my husband, Rodrigo. He's been acting weird, and I just found out he's meeting this woman. Well, listen, I'm not the best person to help with relationship problems. It's not like that. I think she's involved with bad people. Rodrigo might be in real trouble. He's scared, but he won't tell me anything. I can check it out. Any idea when he's meeting her next? Tonight, by the detox center in Greenwich. Okay. Don't worry, Carmen. I'll find out what's going on. Detox center's not far. Carmen just sent me Rodrigo's picture. Let's see if I can find him. Rodrigo. He's really nervous. That woman doesn't seem like a girlfriend. I'll get a photo and see if Carmen recognizes her. You better not hold anything back. Why would I? If that picture that angle. My need to get it over. straight on. Give me the plans and it won't. Easy fake Spider-Man. Very nice. There's no way you're really Spider-Man, right? <laughs> Almost got me there. Yeah, that'll work. Just what I needed. Looks good. Remember, tell anyone about this, and I leak the photo. Plans. This sounds bigger than I thought. I better follow the blackmailer and find out how big. Carmen, I'm uploading a photo to you. Does this woman look familiar? No, I've never seen her. What were they talking about? Sounds like she's blackmailing him. She mentioned something about plans. My husband works security at a casino in Atlantic City. She could be planning a heist, but I'll need more evidence before I can do anything. Let me know if I can help. All right. I'm gonna see where she's taking the plans. I'll be in touch. Another victim? Or an accomplice? I need a photo. No perches with a good angle on this new guy. Looks like it's the underside of the High Line. That took you long enough. Just what I needed. Yeah. As soon as he saw the photo, he fell in line. Rodrigo always was a sucker. Boss will be happy. Let's see the plans. That's what I'm talking about. Gotta catch my train. Don't want to keep the boss awake. Tonight's gonna be our biggest score yet. Hell yeah. How many people are in on this? I've gotta follow him. Where's he getting off? Uh, tapping into the train system should help me follow the train's path. Carmen, the blackmailer met some guy under the High Line. Sounded like you knew your husband. I'm sending you the photo. That's Deshaun, Rodrigo's best friend from college. He went to prison years ago on a robbery charge. Casino plans and a criminal record. Not a great combination. I need to find out who else is in on it. If they're hitting the casino, they'll need at least a wheel man and a safe cracker. I watch a lot of heist movies. Sounds like it. I'll let you know what I find out.
End of the line. I should head over near the subway exit and wait for him to get out. He's heading for that office building. I have all the evidence I need. Now I just have to stop that car. What the hell? Spider-Man? I love it when a plan falls apart. Hey Carmen, your husband's pal and his team just had their trip to beautiful Atlantic City canceled. Thank you. I spoke to Rodrigo. That blackmail photo shows him driving the night Deshaun committed the robbery. But Rodrigo didn't know about it. He was just picking up his friend. I've got a contact on the force. She'll help Rodrigo. Especially if he'll agree to testify about the blackmail. He will. Or I'll show him he needs to be a lot more afraid of me than Deshaun. Thanks, Spider-Man. Hey, do you have time to check something out for me? No, but if you ask nicely... Just got a call about a suspicious-looking box on a rooftop in Hell's Kitchen. I could call in the bomb squad, but if it's just some kid's science project... Yeah, I know. Budget crisis. Yada, yada, yada. So... Will you, please, check it out? There's the magic word. I hope it's some kid's science project. Man, I miss those days. School projects are so much easier than real life projects. We've got a 1010 narcotic still in progress. Need a local unit on scene. Officers needed on scene and message from Doc. Sorry to call so late. My mind's bursting with ideas. We've been thinking too small, Peter. Hmm. Looks military grade. Weird. Spider Man, so you found one of my recon points. Who is this? Wrong question. The correct one is can you stop the bombs I've planted? Mystery man's got recon points spread all over the city. This computer's tracking bombs around the district, and they're about to go off. I gotta move. I don't have much time. Care that one. <laughs> one more, better hurry. I'm 
better. Nice work with the bombs, but you lean into your throat too much. Hurts the accuracy. Is this some kind of sick game to you? Games are for kids, and I'm a professional, and I get paid like it. Guess your client wasted their money. Sometimes information's worth more than money, and I've learned plenty watching you. MJ, what did you find out about Isaac Delaney? Check out the picture I just sent. Which one is Delaney? I don't know. Guess you'll have to go to the party to find out. Good thing I already have a costume. An armed mugging was just reported. Need a unit on scene. Please proceed to Hell's Facts. Over. Stand over here, Tim. Oh, you started without me. Open fire! Finish listening to Doc's message. Sorry to call so late. My mind's bursting with ideas. We've been thinking too small, Peter. Why replace missing limbs with facsimiles when we can improve upon them? People who've lost an arm understandably want it back, but we can give them something better. The human body doesn't need to be our default. We can go so far beyond it. Please proceed to Hell's Facts. Over. Try hitting me! Spoiler, I hit back. Live by the beatdown, die by the beatdown. out here. Better go in. And without further ado... MJ, I'm at location number two. Can you believe these demons wear their masks just like walking around? Must make for confusing staff meetings. I'll try to figure out their operation while you throw a wrench into it. We're Snap time.
Illegal weapons. And this might come as a shock, but I don't think they're really bespoke. The hipster assassins are gonna be so disappointed. MJ, call the police. I've got the place secured. Nice job. Anytime we can get guns off the street, it's a win. 